Last group one day of the year on the A course at Shard 10. It's rated good to firm. Racing in the first and Great King from the inside began fast, but Turbo Power being ridden forward from an outside gate. Smart idea going through in the centre. Fourth is Compulsory from HK Dragon. Next is Hang's Choice and then came Super Kingdom. Two lengths to Choo Chow Warrior and Toronado Phantom on the outside of him. It's the favourite pair with Smart Idea holding the rail. Just racing a little bit greenly. Leads by three quarters of a length over Turbo Power who's second and third is Great King. Fourth is Compulsory. Three wide is HK Dragon from Super Kingdom. Hang's Choice is down on the rail. Then Toronado Phantom and Hard Ridden Choo Chow Warrior. Smart idea with 450 metres to go is the leader. Turbo powers a length to his outside. Next then is HK Dragon from Great King behind them and then Compulsory. It's Turbo Power taking over from Smart Idea. Great King Toronado Phantom is starting to flash home. Turbo Power leads with 100 metres to go. Toronado Phantom is a big danger to him. Here's the perfect start to his career and John Size with another debut winner for the season. It's Toronado Phantom beating home Turbo Power and Great King. Then HK Dragon, Super Kingdom, next in Smart Idea, followed in by Compulsory, Heng's Choice, and Chu Chow Warrior is the last one in. Toronado Phantom, Chad Schofield and John Size combine. Just like they did with Dragon Baby of a few weeks ago. Jeez, produced the first starters again this season, John, to make it one from one. He's got drops of God to come later. Impressive debut, pricks the ears just past the post, the son of Toronado, 16 to 1. And money on all of John's first starters for the season, you'd have plenty of money in the pocket. Turbo Powers run second, he was up outside the speed. Smart idea led up, entirely sure if the saddle didn't shift forward on him either. Genji Stemina out to 3.1 but remains the fave from gate 13. They're off at the 1400. That is a perfect start. Destin's going to lead early. Victorious leader, blazing partners. Kelmimi wins going up wider out, and Shanghai Grace is in the first five or six as well. Then Red Zoffany from Run Des Run. Very wide is Alloy King from Shaw Win Win and Happy Winner. Brave Power next from Fun Time. Zhengji Stamina from the draw went back to second last, and the full bloomers last. It's Kelmimi wins leading by a length and a half, blazing partners. A length and a half away third Shanghai Grace three wide reds off and he given rain to go up and join the second horse from Destin Alloy King improves three wide then victorious leader run des run a happy winner from Shaw win win Zhangji stamina is four wide and flat as a biscuit out there as well followed by brave power well back in the race fun times and the full bloom Kalmimi wins is the leader blazing partners comes off his heels to challenge Destin followed him through and then came Red Zoffany, followed by Alloy King, victorious leader. Zhangji Stamina still makes ground under a hard ride. Blazing Partners, 200 to go. Destin a danger to him. Zhangji Stamina has been flat as for a long way, and the full blue makes late ground, but Destin's darted away here. Destin out by two. Zhangji Stamina, sure win win through the centre to third, but Destin wins it. Destin beat Zhangji Stamina and sure win win. Next over the full bloom from Blazing Partners, Run Des Run, followed in by Fun Time. Happy winner, Alloy King, Red Zoffany, Shanghai Grace, Kelmimi wins, and last in is victorious leader. That'll make Zach's back feel even better. He's had a good start to the day, a second in the first, and then a win for Paulo Sullivan on Destin in the second. He went off at 5.1. His third win at start, 48. Zhengji Stemina. Karras has earned the riding fee there. He was working on him from as far out at the 700 metre mark. And Shaw sure Winwin has run third for Derek Lung. Numbers about to be posted. Followed Blazing Partners through on the rail, Destin. And then he's down and he's done it. Mega bonus. Region Glory both movement in the gates from that pair. They settle. They're racing. Illustrious began well. Victory Scholars out fast and drops of God being driven forward with Nam John Cortez in that line of four. Next region glory from Courageous Knight and Mudita. 
Enjoy My Life is a little wider from Sunday Betting, Jungle Blaze. And well back in the race is Sparky Star from Sky Champion. Mega Bonus and from the 14, Bella Baby is last. Drops have got is the leader. He's got the mouth open, though. Victory Scholars to his outside half a length away. And Nemjon Cortez running third the rail. Fourth, Courageous Knight. Racing Greenly is illustrious and being a hard ridden from Region Glory. Mudita's under a ride from Enjoy My Life, Jungle Blaze. A flat Sunday betting and then Sparky Star and Mega Bonus. Drops of God and Victory Scholars. It's the favourite pair. It's Marira and Pert and they're three lengths in front of the rest. Nemjon Cortez and Courageous Knight. Drops of God though. He dropped Victory Scholars. Courageous Knight's third. Then came illustrious Nemjon Cortez but Drops of God well clear of Victory Scholars and Courageous Knight. John Size. Ditto, ditto. First start, another winner. Drops of God has beaten home Victory Scholars and Courageous Knight. Fourth name, John Cortez. Then Regent Glory, Bella Baby, followed in by Sunday Betting. Uh, next to run past illustrious Sparky Star, Jungle Blaze. Well back, Mega Bonus, Mudita. Hey, back in company with them is Sky Champion and Enjoy My Life Amongst the Tail Enders. Smashes them. Drops of God, number four, Joe Marira, John Size. Effortless. 1.8. Victory Scholars went with him until Joe decided to hit the go button. Courageous Knights run well in third spot for Matthew Poon at 137 for the win. It's 4, 1, 3 and 7. Nem John Cortez running in a fourth spot. He was expected to win. Voyage Warrior just sitting on the back of the gates. They're racing. He was first down, Voyage Warrior, and he's keen to keep the lead too. Computer Patch being ridden along in the early part. Three wide is Courier Wonder from Rattan and Duke Y. Next is Stronger from Sky Field, and the last two, Fat Turtle and Wishful Thinker. Computer Patch and Voyage Warrior share the lead. Courier Wonder went over to be third and was able to drop in just in behind the leaders, but he's got the mouth open and wants to get their head up every now and then too. Rattan four the rail from Duke Y Skyfield stronger. Two links to Fat Turtle and Wishful Thinker. It's Computer Patch. It's not the lead he had in the group one last time. He's had to do some work. Voyage Warriors to the inside. Courier Wonders running third. Then Rattan. Duke Y Skyfield and stronger. Computer Patch leads ahead. Voyage Warrior. Courier Wonders a length away. Joe shaking up the favourite. Duke Y stronger and Skyfield. Courier Wonder and Computer Patch. Then Duke Y Skyfield. Skyfield and Stronger. Courier Wonder is in front. Stronger is on the outside trying to grab him. He's lifting. Courier Wonder. He's holding. He's delivering vases now to Courier. Courier Wonder won the vase and beat Stronger and Skyfield. Then Duke Y. Voyage Warrior. Fat Turtle. Computer Patch. Rattan and Wishful Thinker. He has had to pull out everything there at stages. Joe was hands and heels at the end. He looked vulnerable. But he's got the job done. Courier Wonder. Joe Marira and John Size beats four stronger Vincent Ho and three Skyfield for Blake Shin. Nine, four, and three. Seven has run fourth. He was keen in the run. And at the top of the straight, when Joe asked him to come into the race and he didn't show that acceleration immediately to pick them up, All in. First leg of Triple Trio assistant starter Chris McMullen lets them go. And at the 2,000 metre mark, Dongju Sui was slow and Ezra goes back from an outside gate. Shanghai Dragons going to roll across and find the lead. Cheeky Prawns come over to be second outside of him and three wide is Everlove. Then came Daily Charm from Joyful Heart and Playwise. Down on the rail is Clement Legend. A length to Bullish Glory, Zanjian Rocks and court wide McMoneagle. Dongju Sui one off with Victoria Seeker, Ezra and Nuremberg behind him. Shanghai Dragon heads to the back on the Shingmun River side of the course and leads by a neck. Ever laughs a bit keen to go up and work him and Shanghai Dragon's being urged along to keep the lead. Cheeky Prawns two lengths away, third from Daily Charm. Then Joyful Heart and Playwise from McMoneagle, no luck, three wide. Bullish Glory, the centre, Clement Legends on the rail. 
Two links to Dongju Sui, Zhenjian Rocks. Two links, Victoria Seeker and Nuremberg. Isra's last and 12 links off Shanghai Dragon. He has a 1,000 to go and he leads by a length now. Everlaf has backed off second and the speed has backed off too. Cheeky Prawn third, Daily Charm fourth. On the inside, Joyful Heart, McMoneagle's covered ground. Then play-wise, Dongju Sui. Clement Legends on the fence. They bunch right up from Bullish Glory. Three up, Victoria Seeker from Zanjian Rocks, Ezra. And last is Nuremberg. Shanghai Dragon strides clear again at the 600-metre mark. Everlaughs a length and a half away from Cheeky Prawn. McMoneagle's four wide now, but he's still making ground from Daily Charm. And then came Joyful Heart, Dongju Sui. And next is Bullish Glory, Shanghai Dragon. McMoneagle's never been close to the rail, but is challenging the leader and has hit the front. Dongju Sui is trying to grab him. Bullish Glory, Victoria Seeker makes ground. Dongju Sui, 150 to go. Goes past McMoneagle. There's a wall chasing for Miners. Nuremberg, Bullish Glory runs on. Dongju Sui in front of Nuremberg and he's going to win again. Dongju Sui beat Nuremberg. Third over Bullish Glory, fourth Victoria Seeker. Then Zanji and Rox Ezra. McMoneagle, Clement Legend. Next home is Everlaugh. Dave Daily Charm, Playwise, Cheeky Prawn, Shanghai Dragon, and last in is Joyful Heart. Dong Zhu Sui, Blake Shin, and David Hayes. Horse number four went off at 7.1. Nuremberg second, Jack Wong. And third over is Bullish Glory, the 13. So for the first leg of the triple trio, the winner's gone off at 7.1. The second horse was paying 36 to 1 and the third horse was paying 17 to 1. Favourite the four, all the money for the three. And they're racing. He was fairly away charged. John Copart and Era was out the back at the start. Dandy Years, Free Foal, Red Impact. They're the three leaders from Run Run Good. And then came Super Fast, Wide as Charge On from Super Elegance. Robot Warrior, Trap Wide as well from Copart and Era. Then came El Jefe, and there's no pace on at all. Brave King, three wide figures, two drifting back from Leading Fortune. And New Future is last. Dandy Years, the leader, one off the rail, but has just walked. Walking. Free Foal is three wide and against the inside is Red Impact. The heavily back charge on is four wide now from Super Elegant, Super Fast. And on the inside of those runners is Run Run Good. Then El Jefe and Brave King, who's deeper out from co-partner era against the rail. A length away next is Leading Fortune from Figures to New Future. And Robot Warrior is up running midfield. They're pretty compact still with 600 metres left to go. And Dandy Years is the leader. The margin is ahead to his outside free foal. Charge on has never been on the track. He's been heavily backed and he's coming up three wide into the race. Two links away is super fast. And then super elegance. Robot warrior leading fortune a new future from last. Charge on. He's been wide. He's challenging free foal. Dandy years. Robot warrior gets a go on. New futures down the outside. Charge on. Free foal kicking. Dandy years the rail. Robot warrior. El Jefe joins in late. New future, Brave King, Free Fall in front of Charge On and Free Fall. Free Fall beat Charge On. Third's a photo. We've got El Jefe, Brave King there. Robot Warrior, New Future not far away. Then Dandy Years, Red Impact. And uh, Super Fast, Super Elegance. Co-partner Era was the next to run past from Run Run Good, Figures 2 and Leading Fortune. What a finish. Free Falls won it. Number 10, Matthew Chadwick for Frankie Law. Over the three charge on, and third is either Robot Warrior or Hefe, and Brave King's not far away. Wow, it was, it was a weird race. They went very slowly. Charge on's covered plenty of ground. He went off at 6.9 and free fold the 10. Away they go. 
another good start too. And King Opie, Golden Link, they break the line and go forward. They've been joined by Leap of Faith. Craig Stars pushing through next to the inside and Uncle Steve getting handy as well. Beauty Spirit ridden along early from Trust Me. Then came A1 and the Hulk and Win Win and Flying Victory is last. Uncle Steve across the lead at the 1,000 metre mark. He's out a length and a half, Golden Link and Craig Star is third the rail. Fourth is King Opie and fifth is Beauty Spirit. Leap of Faith one off next and then Trust Me. A1's against the inside and the last trio are the Hulk and Win Win and Flying Victory is a length and a half away last. It's Uncle Steve leading, 6.50 to go. Out a length over Golden Link and third over on the inside is Craig Star. Fourth is uh, King Opie and then came Beauty Spirit. Leap of Faith, A1, Trust Me. And then came Win Win and Flying Victory. Leader for home, Uncle Steve. He's a length clear over Golden Link. King Opie next, Craig Star going backwards from Beauty Spirit and Leap of Faith. It's Uncle Steve. Golden Link won't go away. He sticks to him and he takes over Golden Link. He's a length over King Opie. Here come the descenders. It's the Hulk right down the centre and Leap of Faith through the middle, but it's the Hulk too big, too strong again. The Hulk has beaten Leap of Faith. Flying Victory might have nailed Golden Link for third. Then Beauty Spirit, trust me, next in is Craig Starr from A1 King Opie win-win and Uncle Steve's run last. The Hulk, Karis Teak and Casper Founds, they go back to back. As far as the Hulk goes, 1,200 up to 1,400. He hasn't just won it. He has absolutely smoked them. Second leap of faith. Now third. Flying Victor on the outside has indeed nailed Golden Link. 4, 11, 10 and 7 it will be. Price was Flying Victory, the 10. He was the outsider for Triple Trio. So the winner's gone off at 5.1. A bit of a cheer from the crowd too. Starter holds them. They're off at the mile and a half and time warp from the inside is going to lead early. Glorious Dragon and Exultant coming forward wider out from Panfield Butterfield. Then Columbus County and Packing Waltham and Russian Emperor, the two out of the derby. They drift out to be the last two. Coming down the straight in front of the stands for the first time and time warp giving Harry Bentley his first group one ride in Hong Kong. He'll make his way down to the winning post to lead Exultant by a half a length and the speed's pretty good for a small field. Glorious Dragon and gets a perfect trip third on the rail. Panfield is fourth and they're out by three lengths on Butterfield and Columbus County. A further three lengths to Russian Emperor and Packing Waltham is last on the inside and there's eight lengths over the field. They gallop out to the 1600 metre mark and it's time war pleading. The race favourite and defending dual champion Exultants to his outside second, just racing with their head on the side a touch. Glorious Dragon third and the pace is now out of the race. Panfield fourth they've closed the gaps the four at the back Columbus County and Butterfield and the last two packing Waltham and Russian Emperor. Time Warp leads along the back of the track and they have 1,200 metres left to go. He's out by a length over Exultant and they're just plodding along now. Glorious Dragon the grey third, Panfield fourth a length and a half in front of Columbus County. He covers up Butterfield Russian Emperor and packing Waltham the last two. 1,000 metres to go and Time Warp has slowed down further now. Exultant's tugging for rain on his out outside. Glorious Dragon third the inner. Panfield fourth fifth Columbus County. Butterfield's against the fence from Russian Emperor and last is Packing Waltham. It's the last group one of the season in Hong Kong. It's the standard charted Champions and Chater Cup and Time Warp looking to turn back time. He leads by three quarters but he is being ridden along now. Exultant to his outside. Panfield three up. Glorious Dragon held up. Then Columbus County and Butterfield. It's the old champ it's Exultant. He's found the lead. Panfield's half a length away. Columbus County three up. Then Glorious Dragon. He can't reach them. Panfield's gone by Exultant. Columbus County's on the outside. Panfield and Columbus County lifting Panfield. Columbus County can't get him. Still Panfield. A neck in front. And it's Panfield. Panfield won it. Beat Columbus County and Exultant third. Then Butterfield. Glorious Dragon. Russian Emperor. Pan Packing Waltham and Time Warp has run last. Karis Teton and Tony Millard have won 
the standard chartered champions in Chater Cup over Columbus County. He loomed, but he couldn't get past Panfield. And the four-year-old has won it. Columbus County second, Joe Marrera. Exultant third, Zach Purton. But it's all about Karis Teton today. He has had Panfield positioned just perfectly off the pace. Time warp walked them along. That's helped Panfield being the spot in front of Columbus County. He was. Ready for race number nine. 1,400 metres. They're away. Another good start. Compassion Spirit. Kaishan Dragon goes forward. Elon's wider out. Yo Beauty joins the party as well. Royal Bomb's fifth on the inside from Hall of Champ and then Hulsane Bolt. Two links to Flash Famous and then came on the inside of runners Jian uh, Yin and a further length to winning for all and four links away last of all is Great Treasure but that's not unusual for him. Kaishan Dragon leads a length and a half Elon. Compassion Spirit third. Yo Beauty fourth. Royal Bomb fifth and Hall of Champ on the outside of them and that group of six have broken clear by four lengths on Horsane Bolt then winning for all flash famous Shan Yin and three off last of all is Great Treasure. Kaishan Dragon with 600 metres to go has it by one over Elon third next to the inside is Compassion Spirit. Yo Beauty now asks for an effort from a Hall of Champ who comes into the race. Royal Bomb next from winning for all and Horsane Bolt Kaishan Dragon inside the 400 metre mark leads by a length Elon's going up and down in the one spot and all of Champ joined in and quickly swept to the front. Horsain Bolt runs on, then Jan Ying and Yo Beauty, but Hall of Champ is speeding clear with 100 to go. He's three in front of Horsain Bolt, Jan Ying. They can fight out the miners, but Hall of Champ's going to give Blake Shin a winning double. Hall of Champ by two and a quarter has beaten home Horsain Bolt, Jan Ying, fourth Kaishan Dragon, then Royal Bomb Great Treasure, Elon. Next in was Yo Beauty from Compassion Spirit, and the last couple to run by Flash Famous and winning for all. Hall of Champ, double for Blake Shin. This one for Casper Founds, joined in and ripped away to score. Went off at 3.2. Has beaten the 7, Horsain Bolt. Hasn't got to wait for the photo finish to see if he's gone close today. Hall of Champ, he had that race one a long way out. And Ten Jian Yin has run on well with Kaishan Dragon, the early leader, fading back into fourth spot. His whole great treasure. His four lengths last at the 1,200 metre mark. It's too big a start, but he did make ground on them again. But good day for Blake, winning double. And uh, he's just adding to the season's best tally here in Hong Kong. He's into the 20s now. And Track cleared, all clear from the back of the gates. They're away. Telecom Puma stood there, missed it by five. First to leave is Shadow Runner from a wide gate. He's being pushed forward to lead Magic Bonus, who's coming across with him. Big Two's into a great spot third from Master Hero. Three Widers Love Me More from Brilliant China. And the favourites on the inside, Dragon Fortune. Two links to Ultimate Glory, three wide. Gracie Love going through in the middle. And Super Red Dragons on the fens from Zone D, Go Go 16. Telecom Puma second last and last is forever 15 lengths off Shadow Runner with 800 to go. He leads by about a half a length over Magic Bonus. Big two third. Love Me More was able to slot in to be one off the rail on the heels of the horse in front of him who's outside the leader. That's a great piece of riding by Derek Long. Then came Master Hero, Dragon Fortune, Brilliant China, Gracie Love, three wide zone D, four wide as that pair now start runs and Super Red Dragon, Ultimate Glory, Telecom Puma, Master Hero will make it forever and go, go 16 leader is still shadow runner magic bonus love me more master hero gracie love comes into the race then brilliant china gracie love master hero they square off now two links on big two brilliant china it's gracie love master heroes ahead to the inside gracie love still in front of master hero and gracie love beat master hero in zone d fourth over brilliant china what a great battle between the first two then dragon fortune big two ultimate glory go go 16 love me more super red dragon and then magic bonus well back with shadow runner and the last two in telecom puma and forever wouldn't go away master hero in fact he's come back on the line and he's gone under by a short head nine gracie love chad schofield for david hall 
Master Hero second for Karis Teeson and three zone D for Joe Marrero. Third Brilliant China has run fourth. He looked like he was going to get away and win and win easily. And then Master Hero has rallied so strongly on the inside. But the nine with the late support at 5.2, the second of the hall runners to be plunged. Ready for the last at Sha Tin. Final group one day of the year. And they're away. And it was another good start. Metro Warrior, who has been supported. He goes forward, Chicken Dance. Big Energy away well. Beauty Amigo is now rushing forward to join them from Super Wind Dragon and Hercules. A length to Nam Jong Sings and Killer B is three wide. Tornado Twisters against the rail, then Power Kep Harmony win win. Winston's Lad gets by him on the fence, and last is Classic Posh. Beauty Amigo is taken over to lead by a length and a half. Second is Metro Warrior, and third is Big energy. Fourth chicken dance from Hercules. Now Killer B is four wide. Then came Tornado Twist, followed by Power Kept Nam Jong Sings. Next is Winston's Lad from Classic Posh, Super Wind Dragon and Harmony Win Win. Beauty Amigo leads. Metro Warrior, Mig Energy, Chicken Dance and Killer B are wider out. And then Tornado Twist. Killer B has covered plenty of ground and he's shot to the lead from Metro Warrior. Then came Classic Posh. Killer B's gone clear of Metro Warrior and Classic Posh. This B has got wings and they're very big wings. Killer B won the last and beat Metro Warrior and Classic Posh. What a win. Harmony win-win ran fourth, then Tornado Twist, followed in then by Mig Energy. Next to run past is Winston's lad, Nam Jong Sing's power kept, Chicken Dance, and then came Beauty Amigo, Hercules and Super Wind Dragon. Did that just happen? Killer B. Joe Marrera and Casper Founds, he was four wide at stages and has one hard held. Oh, we've seen a smart one in Courier Wonder win earlier in group company today. We've seen a group one winner in Panfield. Then we've seen this in the last.